Here's a corner of the yard that has been taken over by another person and I was ordered to remove this pear tree because she wanted a Asian pear tree here. So that's a pear tree that I had planted last spring. And the rooting was minimal at the time. So I'm going to show you what the roots look like now as well as another discovery I just made. So this is where I decided to plant it. Here's the tree right here. And here the rooting. This was not on the tree or on these roots when I planted it. There was minimal of secondary roots like this. Now it's just full of them. So that's some pretty good growth. If you look really close you can tell there is definitely some bacteria or fungi growing in amongst it. Little white specks. And here's a discovery. This is a, a sea berry here. I decided to plant it right next to the sea berry so that it can make use of the nitrogen that's being fixed. And here it is right here. These little balls here. That's the nitrogen being fixed by that sea berry. Right there. So I'm going to be mixing the roots of the pear tree right up with the sea berry. And the idea is the pear is going to feast off those bacteria. And in the end, the pear is probably going to kill the sea berry, or the kind of sea berry, but we'll see. Maybe not. Maybe they'll develop a symbiotic relationship. Need to be deeper. That's the root right on the bottom. Okay. built up a little swale mound right here, a mini swale. Now when it rains, it'll collect here and it'll drain, soak into the roots. If it gets really dry out, I can water it here. Okay, take care of my pear tree here now. <laughs> 